You know he misses you guys a lot. All balls to the side. Thank you, brother. So we're gonna switch it up a little bit and play some of the songs that we haven't gotten to play for a long time. We're gonna play a ballad. I know some people are gonna be like, fuck, a slow song. But we're gonna play one of our fucking favorites. And you guys remember a song called My Letter? I wanna hear you sing this shit with me, come on.
So I got a funny story for you. You guys are amazing. Man, if somebody just had a kid over there, I heard it. So, <laughs> what? What? Chris, you're a motherfucking patriot! <laughs> Who didn't, who didn't already know that? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Was that, was that Adrian? Was that Adrian? Who the fuck said that? Yes I, yes I am. Yes I am and yes I will be until the day I fucking die. So I got a, I got a funny story to tell you guys. So this next song we're gonna do is, uh, uh, it was the first song we ever had in the movie soundtrack and it's kind of funny because uh, I thought that that was like, Super fucking huge. I was like, oh my fuck, wait, they're gonna play it in the movie and it's on the CD. And, and uh, so it's kind of funny because I went, and, I went and paid like stupid prices to go see the movie in theaters, right? Got the stupid bucket of popcorn, stupid fucking extra large coat. And, uh, <laughs> and the song was in the movie for like six seconds. Literally, it, it, it was in there, but it was like six seconds. And I stood up and I jumped up. I was like, fuck yes. And everybody turned around, looked like they were gonna fucking kill me. Like, dude, would you please remove this crazy gentleman from the fucking, yeah, they didn't know. Anyway, I thought it would be at least 30 seconds. It was only six seconds. So uh, I guess, maybe that, if it's true. <laughs> So here's what we do. We play a song called Get Up Again, because that's the song I'm talking about. Let's go. Yeah. 
we're gonna play. We're gonna play some off the second record real quick, and then we're gonna do some. We're gonna do something you guys don't expect. How many people have the second record? A lot of people are like, dude, I love your first record. The second record, yeah. All right, so this is the one song we have to do off the second record every single time we come here. You guys remember Medicaid? Remember Medicaid? All right. I'm gonna introduce these guys in a minute too because these guys have pulled something off that I've never seen happen before, but we'll get to that in a minute. You ready? Let's do this. All right. To ride in a mechanical bull. <laughs> this human power. Alright, hold on a second. Where's uh we're gonna do this now? Where's Matt? Matt, let's do this now. Go grab him. Go down the quick. So we got a 
First of all, let me introduce you guys because I know he, a lot of you have seen us before. You know, Rich was in Flaw before. Um, got <laughs> improperly removed against my will. He's back now, right? Oh, no shit, Angel. What's up, brother? <laughs> These guys need no introduction. You guys, have you guys ever met Dan and George? All right, hold on, hold on. Here's, here's the best way to introduce them to you guys because they are pretty much the sickest rhythm section I have ever had the pleasure of working with. You think I'm fucking kidding? I'm not. Show them, show them what you got. This is about, you know, 60 seconds. 60 seconds. So, so this was somewhat pre-planned, but we got a friend of ours. Uh, we got a friend of ours here. Uh, we're, we're constantly supporting first responders. Uh, I don't know if some of you know this, some of you don't. Um, we got a friend of ours, a friend of ours here who is uh, he's ex-military. He's Dallas Fire Department right now, um, and uh, I'm gonna give him the mic for a minute. I don't know what he's gonna say, but he wants to do something. Thank you, Thank you Paul. As he said, thank you, thank you, I appreciate it. I'm a Dallas firefighter, I did a tour in Iraq. All you veterans out there, first responders, thank you for everything. And I would like to show my appreciation for a band that influenced me and that supports showing USA, USA, showing support and awareness on veteran suicide and support and what we go through every day. Everybody just knows that we just lost a Texas officer yesterday. We got the motherfucker. We got him. All right? And I want to show the band my appreciation the best way I can is each giving them a Dallas Fire Station t-shirt. All right? Chris? Chris, you get the USAR shirt USA, for Urban Search and Rescue. USA, USA, you want the USA, 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 you USA, Hazmat, USA, and everybody, my station, Area 51. I wish you guys the best of luck for the years to come. Keep rocking on, all right, guys? Thank you, brother. This is our brother, Matt, and uh, thank you, dude. That's, uh, I don't even know how to explain how much that means to me, dude, for real. You guys, you guys are fucking amazing. Thank you, brother. All right, so, are we getting back into songs? So I'm about to, I'm about to cry in my beard. You know, make me cry in my beard. How about a nice heavy one like Reliance? Fighting 
So just like Matt, he is still serving his country. These are the heroes that we need to take recognize of. people like that in this country, man, for real. And that becomes all of our responsibility. I'm not gonna fucking preach, I'm not gonna fucking go on a diatribe, but it becomes our responsibility as a generation that's raising children right now to raise more heroes. Raise more fucking heroes. This song goes out to all the first responders in this country. It's called Only the Strong Survive.
shopping for a reason I'm wearing like the answer To overcome the grieving I'm like some roaring lessons I'm having in succession It builds my hay Which makes me It's mine And it's your glory I'm facing a time Can't make myself So before we part ways with you, we'd like to say a couple things. Much love and respect to all the bands that played tonight. For real. Make some noise for all the bands that played tonight. And this is one of our favorite places to play in the country. This is an amazing venue. Please support local venues. Support local music. Always. You have to. Doesn't matter who the band is or what they are now. At one time, every single band on this planet was a local band. So please support local bands. Otherwise, we'll lose the music industry. We cannot lose it. The very first single off our very first record, Way the Fuck Back, makes me, every time I talk about this, I feel like my back hurts. Like, am I really that old? Are you guys that old too? Are we really that fucking old? Holy shit. So this song came out almost 18 years ago. Wow. We're fucking old. I know, right? Everybody's looking at me like... This song's called Payback. We love you guys very much. We'll see you again very soon. Oh, you're back into the 
<laughs> that means it's been a good Thanksgiving. All right, so we were in the middle. We were in the middle of the fucking country. We had no place to go on Thanksgiving, and a good friend of ours gave us Thanksgiving. So I'm not gonna break OPSEC and talk about you at all, aside from the fact that you're a fucking full-fledged badass. Who's? He's working on it 20 years. Anyway. I wanted to thank him. I didn't thank him and his family. Where, where's, thank you guys. Thank you guys so much. You guys are amazing. This is this is this is NCO friendly. <laughs> mm. All right. You guys want one more, or you want us to be done? Are we done? All right. We're gonna do something off the new record. Check this one out. It's called Live and Breathe. We'll see you guys over there by Jess. Make sure you go say hi to Jess. She's lonely by herself. As soon as we're done, we're gonna dry off and come hang out. Please don't go anywhere, for real. We're gonna come hang out with everybody. Yes, yes, I got you. Are we, are we done? Should we just, let's just, let's just drink. All right, one more, one more. All right, come on, let's do this.
Get the guys ready. I promise, January, five old man, yes. 